Is Twitch chat ready? No, I'm not in the tournament. I ain't in the tournament. <laughs> Mitch Frog Power. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, go. Let's go. So Bagel is going to start first, and then Old Man Beaterlock is going to be on the right starting second. Nice. We're going to see the pipe rub from the Bagler and Old Man Beaterlock. That's a good strategy. Both runners know how to do their 1-1. One, one. Bagler doing bottom strats. Ooh, Bagler doesn't know about the, um... Okay. Oh, the old man beauty locks. This is why this that, tur that turtle, man, that big jump with the turtle is rough. That 1-1 one, one death. We are in the quarterfinals, and that 1-1 one, one is still wreaking havoc. That 1-1, one, one, this 1-1 one, one is such a jerk. Off to a rocky start here for Old Man Beauty Locks. He's gonna have to, gonna have to secure a lot of points here to bring this back. Now, extra worried about that pit in 1-1, which I also would be. The early on tilt can be real. It, it's something that's happened before, but you can't control it, right? I mean, you're not expecting to take the death there. Um, and he was holding forward into the wall, so he couldn't really... I don't know why he didn't pe like peek into that spot. I don't know. It just seemed weird that it didn't work. But Mario 3 never has to explain itself. All right, Bagler up. Get the tunnel. If Bagler gets the tunnel, he's going to push it even further. Let's see if he gets it. Oh, and he does not get it. And that damage there, that's a good setup for uh, Old Man Beauty Locks to catch up a little bit here. Especially if he gets the tunnel. I, I, I don't know how well uh, Beauty Locks is at the tunnel, but we'll, we'll see. He's definitely practiced it. Most, most runners have practiced Ooh, almost ran to that death waffle. Um, I can see, I, I feel like the nerves are affecting Old Man Beauty Locks a little bit here. As um, just, you can just tell by the, by the way some of his left and rights are. Um, he hasn't really had to second guess himself though, so he should be doing okay. He is behind in time though. So he's gonna need like the, the the back pocket point and stuff like that. <gasps> oh, so close, so close. Bagler gonna get the leap. Ew, team third chest, team last chest, guys. Can we get an ew in chat? Everyone just spam ew. We gotta go team mid chest. Boo. Boo, yeah. Don't worry, he's good. Nice! Old Man Beauty Locks has worked on his new P-Speed strategy in 1-5. It looks amazing. It worked out great for him. Didn't think I'd notice, huh? I'd notice. That's good. Nice cleanup. Uh, did Bagler get Throne Jump? I don't know. Alright, Team Mid Chest. No! Team Chest 3! No! No! All right, Beauty Locks, is he gonna get Throne Jump? He does not get Throne Jump, okay. So we're only gonna be watching Bagler's Throne Jumps from here on out. Moving on to World 2 for both these runners. Both runners team three chest. Not a fan of that.
Middle chest till the day I yeah, middle chest forever, that's right. Yeah, mid yeah, mid chest forever. No take no take backs. All right. Um, I think Bagler still has his lifeline. Nice, old man. Beauty locks going for the fire kill. Fire kills are, um, very. They're very complicated to learn how to control them. Um, and judging by old man Beauty locks last race, he has definitely practiced for some of this stuff, which means that that early game death is very very annoying if you think about it, right? That's a very, very annoying early game death because he's got all these he's got all these things that he's he's fixed from his last races that should keep him ahead and up up the speed with Bagler, which he would normally be on everything he's done so far has been able to keep him on par. It's just that death just set him back a little too much. Not only did the death set him back, but he was unable to get his mushroom as well. So he had to do a slow fortress. Look at these moves. Bagler not landing in the moat. Very nice. He does get the spade card game, though. We're going to wait for Old Man Beauty Locks. Going to have to double down anyways. Spade card game with the 10 bucks. Let's do it. Old Man Beauty Locks going to go for the spade card game as well. Bagler has not fought his Hammer Brothers yet. Old Man Beauty Locks going to see, knowing that the 20 and the mushroom is there, he's going to look at his cheat sheet and see that the 10 is right there. Very nice. Those of you who have been, or those of you who are in the points tournament or have been in the points tournament, is there something about the points that make them like exciting to collect? Like when, oh man, I thought he landed in the moat there. Come on, no moat. Very nice, very nice. Bagler just finishing up the fortress right there. Now I can't remember what I was talking about. I was asking you guys something. Um, but I was swept away from the- Oh! Bagler almost! Almost didn't get P-Speed. Got his red rocket. Nice. Old Man Beauty Lock's gonna do the very consistent, easy, uh, early P-Speed build. I like it, I like it. Nice. Gets red rocket over there. Oh, yeah, no, not to practice for, like, kind of like um, a satisfying feeling when you've acquired a point. Not, like, specific points to collect. I'm talking about, like, even if you get the spade card game and you get the 10 points, like, there's a satisfying feel to getting those points. Old Man Beauty Lock's gonna have to go for the Red Rocket here. I know he's been practicing. He's keeping up with his points. Bagler, not at any RNG points just yet. Well, if somebody threw the red the red shell in there, why would they go and respawn it, right? I think I think I know what you're asking, but I'm not sure. Like if you throw the shell and you miss or something, can you run back and grab the red shell? Yeah, probably. That'll cost you a lot of time. Ooh, and Bagler getting the forward moving bro. That's not gonna help him. If uh, Beardy Locks can get good RNG here, this is a good opportunity, a great opportunity for him to tie it up in points. He has not taken damage yet either. He is in a great position. Oh, as soon as I say something, he almost takes damage. Luckily, luckily he nails it. All right, old man Beater Locks first hammer brother. Moves backwards. This is a chance for him to catch up. Bagler, zombie walks through the block right there. Ghost walk. He made it though. Old Man Beauty Lock gonna do 2-5, right? Yep, 2-5's a good decision. Uh, so don't Never forget it, guys. Super Compromise Bros 3. Nice, just like that, Bagler's out. The Bagler.
Oh, yeah, yeah. No, that's fine. As long as you... Oh, man, Breeder Lock's gonna lose a little bit of time here. Um, but not that much. <sighs> so close. He's gotta not lose that Fire Flower. Bagler got Throne Jump, that's right. Bagler is two for two on Throne Jump, baby. All right, Old Man Breedilox gets backwards moving, bro, and just like that, ties it up with some RNG points. Moving on to World 3, wow, okay, dope. Nice, gonna go for fire kill, very nice. You gotta get all the throne jumps for two points. That's a high point swing. Throne jumps are not single frame tricks either. They're multiple frame tricks. So they're not like, impossible. Yep, um, Teeks, uh, Teeks has done um, all the throne jumps and I Booba has gotten six four three already. No frame jump for Bagler. That's really good for old man Beardy Locks. Has anyone gotten third chest leave? I think so. Yes. I think so. Yep, gotta not lose Fire Flower. Risky jumps though, because you can go right through the boss. Bagler, one step closer to Runaway Bro. Could get the RNG points here. Oh no, Bagley! Okay, he's good, he's good. Lost that Fire Flower. Hopefully he gets Runaway Bro. He needs Runaway Bro to, to, to kind of bring it back a little bit here. And he gets it, very nice. RNG point for Bagler. That's good. All right, Old Man Beauty Lock's gotta get the first frame jump here. Oh, nice try. Nice try. Vegas gonna go for door four here. Ah, oh, no door four, dang. Oh man, Beardy Locks is also in prime target there for Runaway. As long as he doesn't lose his Fire Flower. He almost lost his Fire Flower right there. Very nice. Pick my Momic. No runaway for old man Beardy Locks. He is, however, gonna go for Frog Suit. I wonder what this is for. What do you guys think the Frog Suit's for? Nice, he didn't, Old Man Beauty Locks did not speed run this level last time. So that was a very good start. Very good start. Yeah, I wonder what that frog suit's for. Memes, maybe? Maybe the memes? No runaway yet. Let's see if Old Man Beauty Locks gets door four.
Oh, nice try. Nice try on the door four. Nice try on the door four. Bagler gonna get through with Runaway and not having to use his music box. So that's actually pretty good on his side. Nice, gonna get the H jump. Keep the P speed too. That's a very scary H jump right there. Wow, very nice. Old Man Beauty Locks is killing it right now. So Old Man Beauty Locks could have actually used this music box after doing this level in case the Hammer Brother moved out of his way. Then he could have saved the music box um, instead of instead of using it too early, right? Um, so that's really the only save that I can see in this world. Um, and that's not even a huge time save. That's just something that gives more options. Now, don't forget, guys, Bagler did lose his Fire Flower. Uh, he lost his Fire Flower in 3-2, so he's not going to be awarded that point. However, oh my goodness, Beardy Locks. Way too close. All right. He's got one level left to not take damage, and he can tie up the points. Oh yeah, baby, getting that H jump. Frig yeah. Close to a coin ship. Very close to a coin ship. The Bagler says he forgot to grab Frog Suit. Is there some kind of thing that these runners have? They have a they have a predetermined strategy with Frog Suits here. What what have I got myself caught in? You put door four for Bagler instead of Runaway. Eh, it's still the same. Doesn't matter. Still got one point for it. Right on, Bagler gonna go for bottom P speed. Very nice. Very, very nice. Yeah, we'll leave it. It shows, you know, this character in there. It's the same amount of points, so it's okay. All right, yo, CD crazies. I fixed it. I fixed it. I fixed it. I'm going to get, like, hate mail if I don't change it. Two, four, six, eight, nine, ten. And old man Beardy Locks does it without taking damage. Damn, if he got Runaway, bro, that would have been much bigger. Mitch smells? I can see chat, guys. I couldn't see it before, but I can see it now. I couldn't see it before, but I can see it now. How dare you say that I smell? I do not smell. Bagler's not getting the bestest of RNG here. He's gonna have to chase. He's gonna have to chase that. Whoop! Oh, is this where we're frog suiting? I can't, I can't give the point there, can I? 
He lost the P speed there by... I don't stink! You guys stink! I showered! Like half an hour ago! I don't think that counts, unfortunately. But they did it for the memes. They did it for the lulls. Everyone's telling me I stink! God, I gotta shower, this is a big event tonight. You guys stink! Yeah, how does it feel? How do you like that? Huh? I feel like everyone in the early early 2000s smelled like X. Bangler got the P wing there. Ooh, Beardlock's gonna have to do a little uh, little stop there, but that that's just fine. The Bangler gonna go for his duck jumps here. Is he going to get it? The Bangler's gonna get the third ju duck jump. Twitch chat smells. He's gonna get the other jump off that one. Oh, he's looking good, and he's got it. Very nice. Oh, Beardy Locks is in a situation here. Ooh, Beardy Locks taking the damage there. He's gonna have to wait to bring it back. Uh, Beardy Locks is on emulator, yes. Oh, Bagler missed the throne jump. No throne jump for Bagler. That's unfortunate. He had three in a row. That's pretty good. All right, old man Beardy Locks. Again, is still he doesn't really have to do anything yet with the Hammer Brothers. Minus ten points for smelling bad, all of you. Ooh, mushroom is yeah, mushroom's pretty tough to grab. Nice, he's gonna go for a swim a limb here. Uh, I don't think anyone's ever gotten a PB, no. I don't think anyone's ever gotten a PB um, during a tournament match. I don't think so. It's really hard. Yeah, yeah, fight those, old man. Yeah, yeah, nice, nice. This isn't P-Wing, though, right? Yeah, this cloud. Okay, he could get the P-Wing here. If he wanted. That is the P-Wing. I wonder if he knows that. The P-Wing and the cloud face the same direction. So it's very easy. Oh man, Beardy Locks. Oh, he forgot. Yeah, since you're at the start. Nice, very nice. Oh, maybe he didn't forget. Maybe that's just a strategy, right? You never know. Big, big mountain jumps. Oh yeah, nice, dude, nice. So we're gonna go ahead and mark Beardy Locks as second place so far. He is behind to the point where um, he definitely can catch up, but he does need to... Um, he does need to have a lot of good things, and he's got to get a lot of points. So we're, we're, we'll prematurely mark the second place down for now. And now we are in World 5. No marathon from either runner. Now we're moving on to movements of 4. Old Man Beardilox always holds his own very well. He always does amazing. He, this is his first tournament, and he's already in the quarterfinals, so... It just goes to show, guys, qualify to get in the Warpless Points Tournament. You just need to get under an hour and then throw up a good PB and then uh, sign up. You could be in this. Beep, beep.
But she had time to learn this run? Why don't you, why don't you have time? You should always make time for... I mean, if you're wishing for it, wouldn't that be on the top of your to-do list in life? You know what I mean? You'll, you'll make time, Sean. You'll make time. Ba 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 282 fall for Bagler. Very nice. No movements of four just yet. And old man Beardy Locks. He's on the fastest airship of all time. No, bottom route in five in uh, five two is I think eleven seconds slower, something like that. Yeah, some people call him the Poggler. And since his nickname is the Bagley, we could call him the Poggly. Yo, Poggly. Still no movement of four. He's getting movements of one. Use that music box and he's in the Twisty Castle. Very nice. Can he pause on the airship? You have something to do? I don't think so. Yeah, Mario 3 is a tough game. Here we go. It's a big deal right here. Still no movements before. Old man Beardy Locks just entered. Ooh, the Bagler gets it. The big Koopa jump. Very nice. Come on, get the fly. Very nice for old man. Oh, he had it too. Nice, he knows the duck jump. Very nice. Bagler is going to get the early P speed. Here we go, 282 fall. Still no movements of four for Bagler. The RNG has not been overly nice, although he did get Runaway Bro. Oh no, Old Man Beardy Lock slowing down and taking damage. Unfortunately, he's not going to be able to get it. Still no move. Oh, he's got another music box. It's still no movements of four yet for either runner. There we go. Old man Beardy Locks with the movement of four. I'm still waiting for someone to clip inside one of the ledges in the lava level. Because I know that's happened to me a bunch. No, Old Man Beardy Locks has only gotten one movement of four, and Bagler has not got any. That's two movements of four for Old Man Beardy Locks. He's got his music box, very nice. Over 2 million Twitch 
streamers. 270,000 partners, what do they play? I don't know. I have no idea. They play stuff. They play things and stuff. So, do you like stuff? All right, old man Beauty Locks needs to get this. Also, he needs to get the early P-Speed uh, to prevent Mr. Bagler. Oh, he got it! Very nice. Let's go, getting some points back. Wait, was that moving a four for Beardy Locks? I don't think so, because he used the music box. I mean, if it was a big movement... Did the Hammer Brother do a movement of three up top here, and then there was a movement after that? If so, then it'd be three, it'd be four, yeah. I think it was a movement of four, too. Yeah, then in that case, yep. All right, Bagler's first one is going to be high and low. Very nice, can use this hammer. Old Man Breedilock's finishing up 5-7 right now. And Bagler gets high, high pattern. And a marathon. Nice. Nice game. Old Man Beardy Locks is very close to coin ship here. <gasps> Bagler with the early, the premature, the premature drop down. Gloivin Maving. Oh, Beardy Locks with the missed jump. Both runners dying at the same time. Come on, Bagler, go for the damage boost strat. You'll be fine, right? Old man didn't have fire flower, so he's good. No more marathons for Bagler, please. Nice old man, Beardy Locks getting through 5 8 very cleanly. Oh, thank God he's out of that coin ship range. That's too scary, man. Too scary. And we're about to switch. He's going to have to get the top one. And the Bagler in an uncomfortable spot here. Not going to go for the kill. He's going to wait it out. Not a bad idea. Boom. Give me that. Doesn't have the extra music box anymore for Bagler, so he's gonna have to have a slowdown in World 7. Gonna go for the despawn strategies. Very nice. And I think that's Bagler avoiding. Uh, Star, right? He has not got the star, bro. He did get high and low, I know that. And yeah, what's what star did Bagler got? I didn't think he got a star. Bagler's first battle was high and then his second one was low. Right? I don't think he got an inventory star. He has not marked himself down for it yet though, so we'll see. Old man still uh still on the airship, not much he can do about that right now. I love how there's so many like points and so many different things that happen. Like even like Twitch chat sometimes can forget. All right, very nice Bagler.
Gets the second H jump, takes the damage boost for the first try wall jump. Let's see if Bagler can actually get, um... Is he, is he gonna go for the pipe manipulation? I don't know if he's changed to it, changed to that yet. Let's see. No, he didn't. He's just going for it, man. Just going for it. He doesn't get it. See, that strategy's not gonna work against people like Teeks and Booba who are doing manipulations. Well, I don't know if I is, but I know Teeks is. So we'll see. Who's, uh, if Bagler brings us home, who's his next opponent? That's the question. Old Man Beardy Locks entering World 6. What is his first pattern? High or low? He gets low pattern. Very nice. Ooh, takes a little bit of damage there. Almost died. Gotta clean it up. Very nice. The Peaks Pipe. Is that what you guys are calling it? The Peaks Pipe? Yeah, for open too, man. For open does the manipulation as well. No dicking around. Oh, whoever goes to, wins this goes against for open. Oh, come on. Someone's got to get the clip. Nice, old man. Good use of the P-Wing. We saw Bagler use the P-Wing here, but guess what happened? The premature drop. Nice, he gets the star kill. Let's go. And Bagler is out of there. 36-16. Gets the throne jump, not the one he wanted. Old Man Beauty Locks got low pattern, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, because he took damage and almost died, actually. Everyone in chat, please! I've had enough of your guys' pleasins. You know what? Please, my please, chat. Yeah, please, nothing. How about that? Nice old man Beardy Locks in the level here. He's gonna do his tail swipe. Wow, that was a very nice uh, jump swipe there. Ooh, why? Like, I think that happens when he. Oh! I would, I would have definitely gone for the stomp there. It's gonna go back to the warp zone there. Grab this one, which is a little bit slower. If he would have grabbed the leap um, to the left in the question block, but this is fine. Again, like I said, it's always about what you're more comfortable with. Bagler are gonna go for fire kill. Very nice. I was gonna go for sub pixel manip. He didn't get it, so um, Bagler probably has a really low sub pixel value right now, so he should probably go for duck clip. He should probably go for duck clip. Very nice, very nice. Duck, duck, goose clip. Let's see what Bagler does. He did not move left one pick. Oh, an old man beardy locks. Oh, and the Bagler goes for standing clip. That's okay. Could get it here. All right, old man beardy locks gets low pattern again. Unfortunate, but he did not get a star bro. However, the point he just got is going to be taken away by the death. Unfortunate. Not much he can do about that. Bagler getting gated here. Can't quite get it. He did get it though. Yeah, 7-1 can tie this up if Bagler keeps doing what he was doing. <laughs> like, if the timer starts to run out in 7-1, you might as well go in the level and do it. Although I'd probably be stubborn and just sit there trying to clip until the time ran out, because I'd be so annoyed. Like, there's no way, like statistically with RNG that you wouldn't get the clip at least once by that time. But the game hates everything, so. Bagler getting stuck in time there, trying to save some time. Ooh, that was very close. Nice, pipe to pipe, let's go. Boom. Nice, Beauty Locks finishing up the fortress there. After taking that death, he does get the cloud. Allow to skip level. 
And now he's on three, or sorry, six eights. He's probably gonna do the damage boost. Go for wall jump. Wall jump seems to be everyone's thing. Very nice. Is Bagler gonna get punished? Is Bagler gonna get punished and is he gonna bump in the overworld? That is the question. Da 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 Oh, nice try, old man beauty locks. Da 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 Nice, he gets the wall jump, let's go. What was that, fourth try? Yo, Computer MD, what's going on, man? I don't know, guys. I don't think Bagler's gonna get it here. I don't know why. He, start, he started flying early before maximizing his jump. Let's see. No, he got it. He got it. He's good. 183. Oh, man, Beauty Lock's not gonna get the mushroom there. Clever bitch. Is he gonna get first try 7-6? No. Didn't even get the opportunity. The game hates him. Come on, Bagler. Yeah, nice. Come on, Bagley. Last time, I don't think Bagler went for Hammer Suit Strat. Is he gonna Hammer Suit Strat this time, though? That's the question. Oh, yes, he is. Ah, uh, maybe it wasn't Bagler, but somebody. Da 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 He'll do frog strats? Bagler doesn't have a frog suit, he can't. Old Man Beardy Locks did have a frog suit, but he lost it in 4-1. Don't get stuck in here, Bagler! What?! Why can't I do that?! If he gets mid-clip here... Ah, he got hold in the ground. Nice, Old Man has done the airship, let's go! Um... Yep, he's gonna have to use the star here. He doesn't want to lose his hammer suit. Nice P-Speed strategy. Um, no bonks yet, that's right. Oh, he bonked there. All right, old man Beardy Locks, let's go. Oh, that was a perfect jump for old man Beardy Locks. No bump. Come on, old man, you got this. Pressure. My poor soda can couldn't handle the pressure. Yeah, Bagler missed one throne jump, and that was the world four throne jump. That's unfortunate, man. Nice, old man Beauty Locks getting through. Let's go. We gotta watch for those punishments. There's still some points for him to collect here. There are still some points. Uh, the way this tournament is, is both of them are gonna get no hands.
the stress. Oh no! Oh no! Ooh, I. Uh oh! Guys, I think Old Man Beauty Locks is gonna use those music notes and he's gonna hit the invisible mushroom. Just watch. Watch. Oh no. Oh, he did! I told you! I knew- I know this game too well! Oh, no! I called it! I knew it, dude! Guys, so block. Oh, he fell again! Come on, Beauty Locks, you got this! The Kaizo block was understandable. Yeah, unfortunate. Yeah, it is what it is, though. Come on, Beardy, you got this. Unrelated? Yeah, heck yeah, the hospital's out of the cabinets, of course. Unless it's something that's gonna take, like... Another, like, three months to build them and, and ship them and send them and stuff, because things are a little tight right now. But no, everything got processed and it's going through, so it's good. All right, old man Beauty Locks getting through 7-2, and Bagler grabbing the Wand of World 7. And he almost fell in the pit and died. 292. Gonna get the punish. Oh, 292 or lower. That's right. Get the punish. From that loss of P-Speed. Oh, that's so weird. I don't know why that happened to him. But it happened. Nice. No bonks yet for Old Man Beauty Locks. Oh, the wall rub. That's okay, though. Oh, no, no, you gotta drop! No, 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 you can't! Yeah, you can't enter pipes when you're ducking. I did that same thing, actually. In a speedrun of mine. In one of my speedruns, I duck jumped up, the up there and I started flying, and then I was like, wait a minute, I don't think I can enter the pipe while ducking. Yeah, old man Beardy Locks cannot catch a break. Uh, this run has been really rough on him. I think he said something about uh, he had like a rough day at work as well. So I think um, I think Friday is just not being a bro for him today, which makes sense. I've, I think we've all had those days before. And I think we all know that if you have a bad work day, it definitely bleeds over into home life, which is one thing um, I've always hated about having certain jobs is that like, no matter what, you can't catch a break when you're having a bad day at work. So, you know, it just is what it is. Regardless, everyone has played amazing. So I, I think whatever happens, I'm, I'm happy. I'm happy with how everyone's been playing. But like I said in the Discord, someone's got to lose today, right? Someone's got to lose today. Nice. Be Beardy locks the 770. Still hasn't bumped yet, though. Uh, I don't know if Beardy locks had a bad day at work today, but I, he, he said something about having a, a rough day at work, so I don't know. Like, you could have a perfectly good day at work, but it was rough because there was a lot to do, or you could have a rough day at work because, like, actually being at work was rough, right? There's two different... There's so many different kinds of rough day at works. So I don't know exactly which one he meant, but he did mention work was kind of lame, I guess. Well, I don't know what Beardy Locks does for work, so I don't know anything about customers, but... Oh, what? The music note went through the block? What? All because he he side clipped the bounce. All right, how many hands for Bagler? Bagler is finally out of auto scroller land.
Oh, so close. Um, Beardy... Beardy has enough time to make it to the Air Force. That's, that's about it. Oof. A Fire Flower. I don't know what... I don't know. That Fire Flower was cursed to begin with by going through the music notes, so... And no bonks for Beardy. Very nice. All right, everyone's doing auto scrolls. How's it going, everyone? How you guys doing? Trash Panda, how's it going, dude? How you guys doing today? Join the match right on, me too. This is this a good game? Like I said before, man, having a having a crappy day at work and going home is no different than having a shit ton of homework at, from school. It's the same crap. You just gotta bring that garbage home with you. Very nice for Bagler. Uh, good start to the combo point, 290. Beardy Lock's got a Fire Flower back, very nice. Oh, Bagler missing the sun here. He did get it though, he did get it. Very nice. Nice, gotta get conveyor P speed here. Last point for Bagley's. You guys are crazy, 14s. 14 is like one of the worst ages. Oh no, Beardy Lock's getting stunned. Right on. Yo, Bagler got conveyor, didn't he? Very nice. Yeah, you guys are four you guys are crazy. 14 is like the lamest age to be at. You're too young for anything, obviously, and you're too old to pretend like you're too young. Like you're you're stuck in this like Oh, you're stuck, man. That 14's... I'm 14 easy, Mitch? I don't know what that means. I, I have no remorse for offending a 14-year-old. I'm sorry. You're not old enough to have justifiable offenses. <laughs> you're not old enough to be offended yet. <laughs> You're 30 and you still get treated like a kid? Eh. If I was 14, I'd be offended. I didn't have like bad four, like I didn't have terrible 14s, like terrible twos and, and shit. It's just 14, you're just stuck in this weird spot. Yeah, 14 and 15. When you turn 16, you get this like imaginary respect from everyone. It's awesome. 16's great. I think 
I think the big ages in between there is 13 years. When you turn 13, that's like 13, like the number is like cool. So 13 is like a, uh, an important, right? And then 16, 14 and 15 is just like, who knows what goes on. Very nice for Bagler though. He's going to clutch it out with a high 55 minute run. Very nice. Guys, give your GG's up for the Bagler. Very nice. GG to Bagler winning, winning race one. Uh, Old Man Beardy Locks has uh, about four and a half minutes to try and clutch in the combo point. Uh, hopefully he can make it. Uh, season, season four, I will be adding in uh, the surrender option where you don't lose a point, but you're you're at a point in your run where you know you can't get any more points, so you just surrender. So we'll see. Um, unfortunately, Old Man Beardy Locks is going to get punished there. Um, first place. Um, so 17 to 6 for this one. Never give up, though. Yeah, yeah, we don't want him to stop here. Give him, give him his uh, last four minutes, obviously. Let's switch the audio over. Yo, take it easy, computer MD. Just remember, we all love you. Just remember. Well, yeah, you won't. If, if, if I add a surrender option, like a concede, a concede or a surrender option in season four, you won't lose a point or anything. Yeah, you won't lose a point. If you, if you quit without saying anything, that's obviously a, a forfeit. What did we say? What did we say, man? We knew, we said that, man. I told you, Beardy Locks was gonna get no hands. I knew it, man. I knew it, Gungeon Lover knew it too. I told you guys. All right, dude, Old Man Beauty Locks has enough time for the combo points. We got to see it happen. That would be awesome. Get that one quick point right at the end. Bagler trying to be ahead by 10 points. Beauty Locks is going to say no. Oh, get it back. Ah, oh, he had it. Damn, nice try. Nice try. It was those weird turnbacks. Those weird turnbacks. Oh no, and he takes another death. The run's not over yet. I take the sands of Axor here. Yeah. Maybe jump a couple times? Oh no. Bleed out that time. Take the slow route.
Nice. He's going to make it right to the end here. Very nice. And that is it. That is it. Very nice. Very nice. All right, five minute break for these runners. Five minute break. <sighs> Guys, give a GG to both of our runners. Yo, Shelbs, thank you very much for that resub. Welcome back. Thank you very much, all of you guys, for the resub. Unfortunately, there is no comeback here. Uh, for Old Man Beardalox, I don't think he can bring this back, but these runners can have fun playing a game, too. Yeah, old man Beardy Locks gotta find his happy place. We knew his reign, Beardy Locks' dominating reign had to come to an end at some point. Oh my god, Eternal Samus, thank you very much for the five gift subs. Holy crap, thank you. Oh, Trash Panda with the five gift subs as well. Thank you, man. Yo, thank you guys. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna start getting the the normal streams back, guys. I promise. I don't want to let your guys' support go to waste. I always feel awful about that. It's just been a little busy this month. We'll get back to the normal streams. Get back to the normal grind, and we'll get our we'll get our asses back up to two K subs. Oh, we will.
We will, guys. No, no dicking around. The tournament is good content, but it's it's not the direct content that people crave. People are addicted to it. They need those world record attempts. People go people go psycho for the world record attempts. It's a good shit though. It's some good shit. Uh, we're gonna get the 100% world record back. I'm gonna do some new strats and stuff. I already found like a 13 frame time save in uh, 2 5. So we'll be able to add that. And then we also have the, the point, point 0.4 time save. Point 0.4, point 0.5 time save in um, 2 3 with the green shell. I'm always in the lab, guys. Race in 10 minutes? No, race right now. Race right now. As soon as this race is done, then I have uh, I have my little Friday stuff going on. We're going to watch the new Mortal Kombat, guys. The new Mortal Kombat. The new Mortal Kombat movie came out today. Well, last night. Today at 12. Cordal Wombat? Yeah, that's it. How much time saving Bowser's Castle? I don't think any. Spoiler alert, they're not mortal. MFP wins, fatality. An Australian documentary. Don't forget, everyone, put $20 into Dogecoins, guys. Don't forget, you put 20 bucks into Dogecoin and then sit on it for like four years. All right, you were going to waste that 20 bucks anyways. You might as well bank on Dogecoin going up to a dollar. <laughs> All right, are you guys ready? Are you guys ready for the next race? Yo, thank you for the Prime Gaming. Welcome back for three months. No, I mean yes. Right on. You guys are ready. All right, let's go. The good thing about race number two here is we get to be chill. So I'm probably going to have Twitch chat open uh, for race number two here. All right, on go from three. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Whee! All right, very nice. Both runners doing their standard 1-1 strategies. I don't think anyone was going to put $1,200 on Dogecoin, so. Ooh, taking damage. Invagular taking bottom strat. Reset the scores. That's right. Easy. Watch. Press of a button. R. Done. R. Done. You know someone def put 1200 on Doge? Maybe. Yeah, but you just sit there, right? So I was actually talking about this in uh, somebody else's channel, and they were talking about Dogecoin, and every, everyone laughs at Dogecoin, but you never know if Doge, Dogecoin is going to have the same effect, even though it's fake. It could still have some kind of weird effect that Bitcoin had. Probably not to that degree. Um... Probably not that, but the, the thing is, is that if you're going to take 200 bucks to the casino and blow it and be fine losing it, you might as well just put it into Dogecoin and just sit there for freaking God knows how long. Yeah. 
I've never ever in okay, is Bagler gonna get the tunnel jump though? That's the question. I'm not a huge fan in this. Oh, he almost gets it. I'm not a huge fan with all of this crazy stuff. Like, I really don't give a crap about cryptocurrency. Um, but I've never in my life jumped on one of one of those crazy things early on, right? Like, I've never participated in things that pick up like crazy popularity this or that or make bank off of some random whim for doing something and you know what it will never happen to you unless you try it so everyone who makes fun of everything are the people who don't actually get involved with stuff like that people who made fun of GameStop, people who made fun of bitcoin back right so you know you just gotta it's all about taking chances i don't really have much faith in dogecoin but like i don't know you just you gotta try something and Dogecoin is 25 cents right now. 24 cents, right? Yeah, so whatever. Who cares? Oh! Team third chest not working! Middle chest forever, baby! They're just trying to get Amazon to accept crypto, not necessarily Dogecoin. Ouch. Plain old Jim, that's an oucher. Yeah, guys, don't take out don't take out your savings to buy cryptocurrency, guys. Don't if you do that, you're missing the point. Yeah, you're missing the point that I'm trying to make. Yeah, pay your rent first, guys, please. Joke's on you, I have no savings. Ah, uh, did we get any throne jumps? I don't think so. Oh, <gasps> Bagler, not gonna be able to get the points. Oh, Bagler got thrown jump? Okay. And I don't think Old Man Beardy Locks got the the leaf in the mushroom house. Thrown jump. But Bagler took damage, man. That's rough. Oh, he got the leaf. That's amazing. Thank you, guys. Oh, man. Old Man Beardy Locks catching up. The only thing he didn't get was... Um, Tunnel, right? Beardilox is actually doing pretty good right now. All right, World 2. I should always just scroll down when we enter World 2 because everyone goes for the spade card game, right? Bagler gets the 10 bucks. 10 smackiolas. He wants to get those items though. Oh, he's going for the star more than anything. Okay. <laughs> they passed each other on the streets there. Yo, what up, Beardy? What up, Bagley? Okay, old man Beardy Lock's got some information there. He's a flower. Oh, he's not getting the 10 bucks. He's going to have to go back in later. He got an awkward card there. Nice. No moat for Beardy Locks. That's good. Yeah, gambling is a scary addiction. I'm glad you got out of it. You put all your savings on Teeks winning the tournament? I don't know, man. There's a lot of heavy hitters.
Yeah, I, I, I would never be able to get into gambling an addiction because I've never actually won big money gambling. I've only been a loser. So I, I don't suffer from any kind of gambler fallacies. I never go to the casino thinking I'm going to win. I always think I'm going to lose, so I never really care. <laughs> Old man Beardy Locks with the movement of four. He almost got the combo there. He almost got no death early hammer there. That would have been crazy, but it also would have been bad for him. Would he have known what to do there? That's the question. Nice red rocket for both. Oh, Beardy not getting the red rocket. I thought they both had it. Right, the most I've ever won gambling is 300 bucks. I had $10 down on the pair plus for three card poker and I got three kings. 300 bucks. And that was the next morning. That was that was the next morning. I lost 300 bucks, went to bed in the hotel, woke up the next day, w went and spent the last 60 bucks that I had to spend there. Like I wasn't, you know, I wasn't pulling 60 out of my savings. It's just, I went there with 400 to spend. So I spent like 300 and what, 40 and I had 60 left and I got the three of a kind. So I won my money back and then we left. So I didn't lose. Bro, KLM, you just made bank on cryptocurrency. That's the same as gambling. Guys, don't listen to KLM. He just got like two, two grand or some shit. Eh. <laughs> Most I've ever won from gambling is $2,000. <laughs> nice, old man Beauty Locks getting the 10 bucks. No, I, I know what you mean, Caleb. I know what you mean. I'm just teasing. All right. Come on, old man Beardy Locks first boomerang, bro, went backwards. Less crippling then, yeah. The most money I've ever won at a casino is money that's not mine. Is it really winning if it instantly gets taken away from you? No, th see, that's the problem with gambling is that you have to spend a lot of money to make a lot of money for the multipliers, right? Putting 10 bucks down, even if you get a royal flush on Ultimate Texas Hold'em with $10, you're, what are you gonna get, what? $3,000 and your odds like you could get millions off of a royal flush if you spent enough money Right, it's such a waste to get a royal flush and win like 300 bucks <laughs> Was that did that boomerang bro move backwards? I don't think he did the first one did We can get somebody to double check for me. I don't think both of us, he got one bro that moved backwards. Did the second one move backwards though? It moved forward, okay, okay. That's the way it looked, it looked like it moved forward. I just wanted to double check before I marked it. Oh God, think about how embarrassing that is. To have your neighbors watch your car get like towed. Oh, Bagler not getting the frame jump. Your gambling addict, legit, is it? It's a serious problem. Yeah, I don't know what kind of gambling addict you are though. Is it like you're addicted to the thrill of wondering, "Ooh, am I gonna 
win a million today? Yo, Bagler is on the doorstep of Runaway Bro. Oh, Bagley! Okay, he's good. You work with a guy who spends his whole paycheck at the casino? You don't understand addiction. You don't have to understand it. You just have to be like. <laughs> I want to say you don't have to understand addictions, but you have to be understanding, which that sounds weird, but that is two different things. Understanding something and being understanding is two different things. I don't fully understand what it's like to be a gambling addict, but I understand addiction. So I understand what people go through but I don't understand the addiction to gambling. Yo, type one if you guys are having a good time. Old man Beardy Locks on the doorstep of Runaway Bro. Bagler can't get that Runaway Bro, man. Oh, Bagler with the door four. Did old man Beardy Locks? Wow, door four. Did old man Beardy Locks get the um, frame jump in 3 1? I don't think so. Ah, oh, he didn't get Runaway Bro either. Yo, June 1st, guys. I'll be no smoking cigarettes for four years. What the hell? That's a long time. Nice, Beardy Locks. Beardy Locks still has not taken damage. Unfortunately, oh, Bagler getting greedy. Bagler is getting greedy, man. He's going for the hammer and the runaway. Oh, the greed, it paid off. It paid off that greed. The greed. Nice, old man Beardy Locks get, not getting Runaway either. Well, not yet. Gonna go for door four. Come on, Beardy Locks, you got this. Oh, man. I always think each runner has it. Like, I'm, I'm so far off from, like, knowing. You're on McDonald's Wi-Fi right now? Nice. That's some good addiction. Unfortunately, Bagler is in a position where he still has to use his music box, so not much he can do about that. Come on, we need an old man Beardy Locks runaway. Nice, he gets to go without using a music box, that's good. And eating all the fries. I've never actually, I've never gone to a McDonald's and just sat there and hung out, just like constantly ordering medium fries, like chips. Never hung out at a McDonald's. I've like overstayed my welcome. Like I've gone, ordered a meal, sat down, ate the meal and like sat there like a gross hog for like 10 minutes and then I left. I've done that before. Free refills? Yeah, man. Live that life. You know what's crazy? I ruined my credit card last year. Not even 12 months later, I got my credit card score back up to 100 points. Now that is weird. My entire life, I grew up fearing that if I didn't make one payment, nobody would ever hire me or, like, sell me at least anything. My parents, like, instilled, like, a fear in me.
These runners are doing great, man. These runners are doing great. We're, we're having an amazing combination of Twitch chat interaction uh, during race number two here, and the runners are still clutching out a lot of stuff here. Uh, Bagler lost his Fire Flower already. He lost it in World 2, I think. Beardy Locks has not lost it. And I don't think either runner is eligible for Throne Jumps. I know Bagler got one Throne Jump. I don't think he's got all three. Somebody will remind me if Bagler got all three Throne Jumps, but I don't think so. And um, Old Man Beardy Locks uh, hit the shell for Red Rocket. His second Hammer Brother went backwards. Didn't get Tunnel. He has the Leaf. Um... He didn't get frame jump, he didn't get door four runaway, but he hasn't lost his fire flower. So as long as he can do this without losing his fire flower, he should be good. Everyone else loves Ned Flanders. Oh, that was too close, Bagler. When when are they... They both talk about getting the um, frog suit. When are they supposed to use it? Yeah, maybe they're going to use it in 4-4. I guess old, I guess Bagler is forgetting to use it. I, he didn't lose it? Like, I got to give him that point. He kept it the whole time. If he didn't keep it, he obviously... Oh, what? He was standing on the very block that broke. That is unfortunate. Bagler with the marathon. Big marathon. Um, Any day now. Wow, that is unfortunate for Beardy Locks. He, he broke the block he was standing on by throwing that turtle shell. That's kind of a funny... That's a funny thing to happen there. Thick. That's right, don't meme. Wow, Bagler is in a horrible position right now. Um, yeah, he's in a horrible position. Uh-oh. He's trying to go for the- Oh! No duck jump! He's, he technically still kind of net even because you never get- Oh, that was almost a marathon. Because you never actually get- the movements of the marathon in World 4, so it's pretty much the same as any other World 4, the amount of points. So he's got to fight the two Hammer Brothers up top. I, I don't know if the cloud is right away or not. You never noticed the music box played the SMB1 theme? Which theme? Oh no! Oh no! Bagler! 5-9! Play 5- No! Play 5-9, you turd! He's going for it though. Yeah, he should've just played- Yeah, he should've just played 5-9. That's okay. He's never been in that situation before. He's never been in that situation. Oh, 
Wow, very nice for Beardy Locks. That's really good. No, I don't mean 4-5. Just skip the cloud and just play 5-9. That way he doesn't have to really do a whole bunch of stuff. Yeah. Yeah, which would never happen in a normal Warpless run, right? Oh, he used the frog suit here? Don't... Don't die, Bagler! That's all good trash, Panda. Nice, Beauty Locks doing 4 4 here. This has been an awesome run for both of our runners. Both of them are experiencing some very weird stuff. While, while me, while Twitch chat and me are shooting the shit watching these guys, this is a, it's almost like we're all just hanging out watching our buddies play games, which is exactly what we do all the time. But I don't know, this one feels different. This one's fun. Frog suit, airship, point next season? Unfortunately, no. Maybe. I don't think so, though. You have to use this music box here. Very nice. And go for the duck point. Oh, he missed the duck jump there. I think he realized the first one he had missed. No, I wouldn't do that either. I'd have to make it more intense. Beat an entire world as Frog Mario. Three points. Obviously, Bagler's not going to get the three points there. <gasps> no, Bagler! Oh my god, he could have gone right through it. That is so risky. Does it... Am I a bad person who kind of wanted Bagler to die there just because, like... Old Man Beauty Locks would be in the lead. It would make things a little interesting. You did too, right? Like, that was close. That was way too close, that's right. Yeah, that's awful. Hey, someone's got to lose today. You guys remember National Treasure? Someone's got to go to jail. Someone's got to go to jail. Unfortunately, it was Boromir. When Boromir was done in Lord of the Rings, before he died in the forest, he started robbing for the for the National Treasures. <laughs> Very nice for the bagler. Someone's got a lotto, might as well be you. Someone's gotta put money in Dogecoin, guys, or else or else how is how are people gonna make their billions? <gasps> oh bagler with the war rub, I don't think he's gonna be able to get it here. Now, I don't think Bagler's going to use his lifeline. Yo, Gravy Bo, thank you very much for the four months. Welcome back. Hey, moving to four for Bagley. Bagley, unfortunately, not going to get the 282 fall, unless he did somehow, but I don't think so. Nice, Beauty Locks getting the kill and moving on to World 5. Yeah, Feropen used his lifeline, though. That's So, in the finals, I think Feropen is the only one. Whoa! 
Mortal Cobra, thank you for the 10 gift subs. Extremely generous. Thank you very much, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Another move to four for Bagley. Very nice. All right, old man Beardy Locks. Teeks, Booba, and Bagler still have it. Mondi, does Mondi have the lifeline? Well, thank you very much for supporting it, Mortal Cobra. Um, you guys supporting it helps fund the tournament because I, I fund and create uh, everything on my own. And since a large portion of my money comes from you guys, uh, yeah, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Since you're 14 and lame, yeah, 14 is a rough age, man. We, we went over this. So we pay your salary. I mean, it's not a joke. I mean, that's an, a very well-known thing on Twitch, right? The communities, that's the way it works. Bagler, get the big jump. Beardy Lock's taking damage. Is he gonna be able to do this? Oh, he went right through him. Wow. Wow, that was insane. Big Koopa jump though for Bagley over here. Roll five, no 282 fall for Old Man Beardy Locks. Bagler is going to get early P speed. Very nice. Gonna grab the leaf. Didn't want to grab that. Yes, guys. In a sense, you guys are kind of my boss. Yes. All right. That's what I should tell my neighbors when they ask me what you do for a living. Oh, I, I go on camera and then people donate. <laughs> They'll be like, oh. Okay, they wouldn't ask any more questions. Yeah, I have three webcams in a room and I press li go live. And, uh, yeah. There it is, Bagley with the movements of four. Oh man, Beardy Locks with the movement of four as well. No, that is accurate. No, it's, it's true. That's not... Do I have only? No, I don't have only fans. For the longest time, I thought you only had to do like sexual content on only fans, but you don't have to. Uh, Bagley just getting only movements of four here. Are you guys like bosses or shareholders? Um, I don't. Th I don't think you guys would be classified as shareholders because you're not actually getting shares in anything. You know, I can't actually create my own cryptocurrency and all that weird stuff, so you guys, you know, you could, I guess, but I don't think so. Nice, very nice. Uh, so we can't give the point yet to Bagley because Beauty Locks has not done the level yet. You did get early P-Speed, but you you don't understand exactly how share points work. Type exclamation tournament and check out the rules. Nice, old man Beardy Locks is good. He's in there. Big Koopa jump, that's very scary. Uh, the way shared points work is it it's a combination of whether they both get it or don't get it. So if old man Beardy Locks doesn't get it here, then he's got to, ooh, another movement of four for Beardy Locks. He needs, no, that's it, right? Oh, that's. Yeah, that's three for Old Man Beardy Locks. And he did get P-Speed. Very nice. So neither runner gets the P-Speed because he got it. See how that works. Easy points right on. Very nice for both these runners. All right, Beardlox is gonna do that. If I don't get Fire Flower, I can't lose it in World 5, and that's a pretty good strategy. I like it. Mm. 
Mm -hmm. All right, Bagler, very nice. Man, the beardy, the, the the pipes have not been nice to beardy locks lately. I can assure you, most people, including thine self. All right, Bagler's first hammer brother is going to be. Hi. Oh, Bagler's getting high patterns. But the Hammer Brothers here, very nice. Guys, get your 420 gutter mind out of here. Bagler got high. Very nice, World Man Beauty Locks. Getting out of World 5. Oh, Bagler is almost in coin ship range. Have you guys ever heard of a movie called, um, oh, why didn't Bagler hit a coin block there? Wow, he's risking it. Have you guys ever seen a movie called Training Day? Yeah, last night was the first time I ever watched that movie. <laughs> I'd never seen that movie before. What is, I love Denzel Washington too, man, he's great. I don't know why I never saw that movie before. <laughs> Training Day is a classic. Nice, Bagler is out of coin ship range. Beardy Lock's gonna get out of the auto scroller now. Yes, let's go. Uh, I don't know if training dates on Netflix. All right, Bagler is going to get low pattern. Very nice. Getting the highs, getting the lows. And unfortunately, he got a, a, an inventory star, so he's not gonna be able to uh, capitalize on that. It's like that, and that's the way it is. That's the only line that I don't like in that movie is King Kong ain't got shit on me, like... What? You wouldn't stand a ch- Nobody wouldn't stand a chance against King Kong. Alright, old man Beardy Lock's first pattern is going to be low. Get low. Let's hope Old Man Beauty Locks remembers to- Oh, he's getting a marathon. Oh, nice, nice. I do have HBO Max. I'm going to be watching the brand new Mortal Kombat movie tonight. Oh, Bagler gets it first try! Very nice for Bagler. Oh, Beardy Locks ran out of his star. That's unfortunate. Can he get the floor clip, though? Oh, nice try with the floor clip. Wait, did Beardy Locks just take a death? Okay, 
Okay, he was just sitting there looking at the hammer. Okay, okay. Yeah, he's trying to figure out the HPs. Oh, man, that was close. He almost took a dead there. I would love to see Bagler win the tournament. I'd love to see that. Guys, I have no... I still have no idea who's going to win yet. Like, I have no... I haven't picked anyone. I have no clue. I think Teeks might have it. Third season in a row for Teeks here. I think... I think... I think Teeks can bring it home. Very nice roll, man. Beauty Locks there. Not, not to cancel anyone out, it's just... You know, if I was playing Fantasy SMB 3 Points Tournament, I would, you know... Oh, Oral Man Beardy Locks unfortunately is gated by the wrong Hammer Brother, and he got another low pattern, and he's not gonna get... Damn, Hammer Brother's not being cooperative. He does get high pattern here, though, so he is going to get at least one point there. Very nice. He's got to remember to use that leaf, though, right, guys? Very nice for old man Beardy Locks getting the P speed strategy. Can we just talk about how fast and how good old man like old man beardy locks got really good at this game really fast i think with how fast i think i'm most impressed by how fast oh no no i was just giving you all the praise old man beardy locks you have the- you forgot to use the inventory leaf. Oh my gosh, what? If he remembers to use it here, guys, do we give it to him? He's just seeing now that he forgot. I don't think- I don't think that counts, guys. Yeah, I don't think that counts. Yeah, everything is, um, essentially first attempts only, yeah. Alright, Beardy Locks, take this point away from Bagler. Get wall jump first try, man. I want to see a first try wall jump. I want to see a first try wall jump. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, Beardy Locks in the first try wall jump takes the point away from the Bagler. That is amazing. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go. Sometimes getting the mushroom in this fortress kind of throws everything off, right? All right, let's see if Bagler's gonna get punished here. No bump. How long has Beardy been playing for? I, I swear, not even a year. Like, he's- I feel like Beardy Locks has only been actually trying for, like, six months. There you go. Yeah, five months. Beep, 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 beep. Ah, oh, Bagler. Uh, did Bagler get the 83? I feel like he didn't. He did? Okay. It's just his jump always trips me up. Oh, 
Oh, come on, man. 7-6 has been very mean to Bagler. 7-6 has been very, very mean to Bagler. Uh, Bagler has been a serious Mario 3 runner for at least a year now. He's practiced probably for like two or three years and played for a long time. He probably played a lot as a kid. Like, he's very experienced with the game, I'm guessing. But in terms of actually seriously speedrunning, I'm guessing Bagler is not even a year yet or one year. I, I want to see Alice actually come back and clean house as well. I want to see Alice. <laughs> he stopped, man. He stopped because he's like, screw this crap. And then he got it. I want to see Alice. So I've noticed uh, I've noticed a few things with Alice's speedruns where she gets hit with a lot of jank. I think Alice should definitely go back to the lab a little bit. Right? Put, put some runs on pause for a little bit. Go back, learn... Um, and get into the groove of some of those different kind of strategies, and I think she can come back and she'll get a PB very fast. I think she can clean up Season 4 if she tries really hard. I think she can. Not to say, you know, she didn't try in, in this season, but yeah, hey man. Mario 3. As, as some part of it, you have no control. Alice is also new. Yeah, okay, apparently Bagler last November, last year, last November had a 59-minute warpless. Yeah, so he probably was familiar with Mario 3, did a lot of research, a lot of a lot of practice, and then brought it down to a 51. Bagler going for the clips. Oh my god, great clip. Is Giga still running? Giga just threw down a 50 a 51 uh, 14, I think. How come Haxer didn't enter? He's afraid of all the good runners. Yeah, Giga just got a 51-14. Giga is... Uh, he's a, he's a weird Mario 3 runner. I don't think, I don't, he doesn't really care much for speedruns.com. He, he doesn't, he's not a huge, uh, he's not huge into it. Oh, Beardy Locks with the fanfare. You hate to see it. That's two fanfares this tournament and two coin ships. Two fanfares, two coin ships. He didn't get punished, though. He didn't get punished in that level. Uh, Bagler did not do any bonks, so that's good. Oh, nice try, Beardy Locks. Dang it. Hopefully he can get 7-6 first try. Oh, dang it. Nice try, though. Come on, old man Beardy Locks. You can get it faster. You'll get it faster. Bagler lost like... Yeah! I feel like Bagler lost like two minutes in this level. Something like that. It low key bothers me when top runners don't get submitted. Or you mean like they don't submit it? Yeah, it's very annoying. Because down because top runners are supposed to be the a representation of high level gameplay for a community and they just they, right? They just I don't know, it's weird. It's like 
It takes two seconds to follow the guidelines and submit a run. It's like two seconds. Hey you, how about lending me your clothes? No dice, what a drag. That king promotes gambling with dice and smoking. Drags. Old man Beardy Locks just bunked? Oh no! Old man Bonky Locks. That's unfortunate, but that's okay. Some people just don't care about how they do compared to others. You, you think that, but it's that's not the case with these runners in Mario 3. Is gonna get 17 points here if he gets the if he gets uh, the conveyor. So is there something that I don't know about speedruns.com? Why do why would anyone dislike speedruns.com? There's only one thing that I disliked about speedruns.com that pisses me off is that they make me re-enter my password and username every month, and. Uh, that for me is annoying with the way I have my passwords set up, like IRL and stuff. So that that's annoying for me, but not because of the site. It's annoying because it's just extra work that I have to do. That's annoying. Not not my security. I love the secureness. <laughs> I need your clothes, your boots, and your hammer suits. SRC has some shit service that always likes. Yeah, but like, does anyone here actually hang? Like, I don't. Does anyone here hang out in speedruns.com? Like, I never watch anything or hang out there. When I go there, I go right to the Mario 3 tab, verify some runs, submit some runs, and then that's it. I'm out of there. If anyone is like, oh, what's the world record in this? I just go to speedruns.com quick, check out the game, and it's right there. Or just Google the name of the game with speedruns.com. It'll take you right to the page. Like, I don't hang out at speedruns.com. Yeah, it's just a leaderboard site. I don't know how people get mad at it, right? You keep your passwords in a mayo jar in the backyard? Forum post notifications, what? In the top, in the top bar there? Oh, Beardy Locks taking the damage. <gasps> don't get stunned! Whoa, Beardy Locks surfing on the boss. That was sick. I get mad at people getting mad at speedruns.com. That's where the... Oh, Bagler with the no hands! So many no hands this tournament. Guys, somebody has to go through all the races and count how many no hands we've gotten so far. Somebody actually needs to take all the races, all the hand bridges that we've crossed. So however many races you just do each race Two people cross the hands, so four hands, four hand crossing per race, and see how many hands we got. And see what the uh, statistics were for no hands for all the races. You got three no hands in your races, Raycord? Jesus. Old man, should Mercy quit? No, he's got eight minutes. He can make it to the combo points and get his career total up. Haxer is doesn't play Mario 3 anymore. 
Okay, he played. He's doing randomizer. He hates randomizer more than anything, but still signs up every year for it. Every year. <laughs> I love it. It's I find it hilarious. Oh! Backwater! Is he gonna get the combo point? Yo, okay. Guys, you think I'm lying, but I'm not. You think I'm lying, but I'm not. Haxer hates randomizer so much that he forfeit last year in one of his earlier matches. And then that was it. Whatever, it's all in good fun. As long as everyone's having a good time. All right, get conveyor belt. Bagler got the combo. Hopefully Beauty Locks has enough time. No, it's no shit talking, just busting, just busting balls. Hey, okay. All right, conveyor P speed for the Bagley. It's a big deal, but in all seriousness, um, yeah, Haxus just wants to play SMB1 and he's just a little burnt out with Mario 3, which is totally understandable. When I got when I got the world record of Mario 3 when it was a fit when it was 55 minutes, I didn't play Mario 3 for six months. I didn't touch it. After I got the 55 world record, it had the MFP tunnel in it, and this was around 2015-2014. Uh, no, this was 2014, I think, or some, some, some crap like that. I don't remember. 2013 or some shit. What did I play for six months? I didn't really play games. Damn it. Hand one for Beardy Locks. World record was 55 back then. That's right, I got the first sub one hour in Super Mario Brothers 3. I got a 59 something, the first sub hour, and it got rejected from the website, Speed Demos Archive, and then, and then I got a 57, and then that was accepted as the world record. That was the world record at the time. And then for a year or two, throwing it back and forth with Karua between 56s, and, and then, uh, then I got the 55, and that was a big run. That was a good run. Oh, I played lots of games, just at that time, I wasn't playing any games. Okay, very nice for Bagler. He's gonna, he's gonna clock in at a 5603, it looks like. Something like that, right? Everyone get your GG's out for the Bagler for advancing to the semifinals in the SMB3 Warpless Points Tournament. Also, I want everyone to give GG's to Old Man Beardy Locks. Um, he was a little out of his class there, but he did, did come in, throw down some points, have a good time, and he has enough time to secure two more points for a career total. Oh, what? You want to see this stuff? Oh, there's nothing really to see. It's just time timer. I don't think Beauty Locks is going to make it. This is, so, man, compared to the points that Beardy Locks got, a five, a five and a four here so far, this is not, it just, it just might not be Beardy Locks' day because 
He's played so well in this tournament, and it just seems that this one matchup alone... Regardless, I wouldn't be too... I wouldn't be too hurt... Oh, with the death! I wouldn't too, be too hurt about it, mainly because, like, he made it to the quarterfinals. That's really far. Um... I'm, pr I'm pretty sure Antiques can back me up here, but Old Man Beardy Locks actually has the slowest time in Warpless in this tournament, doesn't he? One of them. And he made it to the quarterfinals. Amazing. Correct, right, yeah, so Beardy Locks has the, well, I guess highest time. He's got the highest time in Warpless in the tournament, and he still made it to semifinals. That's amazing. He doesn't want to die again. He wants to he wants to make it to the conveyor room, get that one last point. That's what I like about the points tournament. That's right. Everyone has in the first round you're 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 seated up against somebody with a, a PB similar to you, so the skill level is the same. And everyone has equal opportunity to advance to the next bracket. Then from there, it's up to you to decide how you want to approach it with points and time and stuff. You got to scope out your opponent, see how everything goes. Ah, oh, he gets conveyor P speed. Amazing. Let's go. He has just enough time. Just enough time to finish this fortress, and we're gonna have to call it, ladies and gentlemen. But, we are gonna give Beardy Locks the juicy raid, because we need all of you guys to go give him a GG. Give him, cheer him up a little bit. I think he had a rough day at work, and we all know what that's like. We can all relate. Very, very nice from both of our runners. Insane. Awesome job. Well, if he dies at the one hour mark, he's good. Uh, what do we get? Uh, 17 to four. Get a point, lose a point. Oh man, unfortunately it happens, but let's all go over and cheer Beardy Locks up. Let's all let's go. Let's all go over and cheer him up, guys. Everyone go over there. But don't forget to give GG's to the Bagler because he also deserves some hype too for advancing and winning and getting into semifinals. We're also gonna give Beardy Locks some love here. All right, I will see you guys all tomorrow morning for another match. The last quarterfinals race, iBooba against Monday. Tomorrow morning, uh, I think 9 a.m. my time. 11 Eastern or it's 9 Eastern. I can't remember. You just check the schedule. Okay, so it's 11 Eastern, guys. Tomorrow morning, 11 Eastern. Last race of quarterfinals. Very nice. All right, let's go raid them beardy locks. Let's go see him. Well, shit. <laughs>
Mad props to Bagler, man. Oh, you know what?